But you know me, I love Paul, man. Paul Williams is always going to be one of my top fighters, uh, you know, because I, I got to stay with him. I ride with him when he first came in there. I just didn't agree that they compared him to Thomas Hearns. Thought he was gonna improve over the years. Yeah, Paul ain't he ain't been sick. He ain't never done. Only reason he had half a career because they knew they knew he was a lame ass dude. Let's throw this off that cookie and hustle away so he can look good. So he moved up, his ball dropped out eight percent. All I heard in Hustle Way was he scared to fight. I'm next, I'm next. <laughs> what else? Where the fuck are you? <laughs> Where he was. Paul. Oh, yeah, and that's what you see. The small world's just going to like that. Now, how did you compare a man with a scared dad like that to get man hurt? He's not going to sweat. He's not going to thread off people's gloves when they blocking his shit. And you're going to compare this man in a sentence with, with this, this sparring motherfucker. Oh, I didn't put him in the same sentence they did. That's I fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I'm in Thomas Hines in a sentence. Unless you flushing him down the toilet. That's the only way they should be putting the thing. Thomas Hearns will flush him down the toilet. <laughs> you warm up harder than this motherfucker punch. Please. <laughs> you don't even pick nobody up. <laughs> and Tommy had no deep when he had him. You ain't gonna run up on him because he ain't right. He is pretty rough. He ain't worried about shit for Paul because they know. This is gonna be the motherfucking tap dance show. <laughs> <laughs> when Paul got some D, I mean Paul ain't no just both. Oh my god, man. This is this is the kind of night I'm talking about, y'all. I'm just gonna let it go right now. This is the type of night I'm having. I gotta mute him because it's gonna get crazy. This is just part one of the whole story. This dude is Kermit Centron out. He thinks Centron going to knock Canelo flat out in four rounds. And, I mean, he's been debating me, Sean. It's all over the place. This is Centron's number one fan, and he cannot stand Paul Williams. But he ain't like Paul Williams from the jump. Now, as soon as he came on the scene, he was against Paul Williams. And he knows that I roll with Paul, me and my boy Chuck. And that was it. And it's been on ever since then, man. Anytime Paul looked bad or something went wrong with Paul, he come with the I told you so. So he going to make us eat crow on Paul Williams all the way through the line. But I was like, I called it like I see it. I was like, he had flaws. And I point out his flaws. It still ain't good enough for old T. T going to let you know straight out exactly what he think about a fighter. He will not change his words. He is still the same person he's been for years. And it's always been F. Paul Williams from the jump with him. And you see why. Especially when they compare him to old school fighters. That didn't really did it. You didn't seal the coffin on him with Thomas. When they brought up that Thomas Hearns and Paul Williams analogy, it was over then. <laughs> 